Esta dice. Por Kenia. Por Kenia. Simba, Simba. Friday morning and a team led by Tongaren MP Aseli Simiu was at the Registrar of Political Parties offices to submit from PP7. The team was at the venue yesterday where they were advised to produce the document that indicates the number of National Executive Council members in support of the new party leadership. Today's visit coming in the wake of upheaval within the party with the Selly camp and that of Bungoma Senator Moses Wetangula seeking approval to be the bona fide officials of Ford Kenya Party. We, ha we have been here to present to the registrar from PP7 which has been uh, properly uh, filled in accordance with the law with the required signatures of authorized officials of the party. We have received, we shall again review it and deal with the next course of action. Now out there what's happening is our colleagues are actually st sending intimidating statements and threats to the members of na the National Executive Council who are part of the special National Executive Council that we held on 31st, 30th and 31st. The development coming as members of county assembly allied to Ford Kenya party in Busia County condemned the attempted leadership coup in the party purporting to oust our tangula. Led by Bunyala North MCA Fred Musirimba, the word reps stated that they support the decision by the National Executive Council to suspend errant members who participated in the party changes. We want to categorically state that as a branch, we only organize Honorable Senator Mose Wetangula as the bona fide Ford Kenya Party uh, leaders. We pledge our and our support uh, to him. This is to Galpenda Kuliza, Walitumia Binugani. How was it to Kachukua Watu, Awili Watatu, Muketi Nao, Koteli, Alafu Semekua, Umechukua Cham? Similar sentiments were made in Kakamega, where former Senator Bonnie Halwale told of Governor Weekly for Paranya and Kotu Secretary General Francis Atoli accusing them of being behind the current political challenges facing the region. Tungependa tumwambie atuoli na oparanya na wangamadi. Kwamba kutumiwa kumudhulumu wetangula wa mnyanganyo cha machake. Sisi tunakata. Hata kama wetangula ananuka, yeye ni wetu. Elsewhere, Kirinyaga County Assembly Jubilee Party Caucus has told of Party Secretary General Rafael Tujo of a plan to discipline 10 nominated MCAs and Assembly Majority Leader Kamau Morango for supporting a motion to impeach Governor Ann Mumbi Waiguru. The caucus, convened by Assembly Majority Leader Kamau Morango and attended by Speaker Anthony Gadombe and over 20 MCAs, accused Tuju of obstructing war on graft in Kirinyaga County. Na saa hii tutaendelea kuandikia mbarua speaker wa mbunge kulingana na kanuni za mbunge na pia tutaandika mbarua katika chama cha njumbiri kulingana na katimba ya chama venye inaeleza ili kuhakikisha kwamba hatutakuwa na mzaha msaha njuzi. Sababu hiyo mzaha msaha imekuwapa ya kuita chief whip, chief whip, mtu wanaamuka naanza kufanya wamuzi tumeona sasa tunafaa tuwe na watu wamba wanajua venye wanafanya Meanwhile, Naivasha MP Jane Kihara is decrying isolation of certain MPs by national government in implementation of ongoing capital projects in their constituencies. Kihara says cabinet secretaries have been visiting her constituency to inspect government projects without her knowledge. That's not how things have always been done. You know, I'm not, I've been in leadership for a while now. Anytime a minister comes to your constituency, you used to know. Because ata kama ni, ni yo chakula inaletwa, most probably mi ndiyo nitakuwa na, 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 na information ile ama habari ile inge msaidia. Kevin Washera, Channel 1 News.